The cause must lie within the egg itself. How's egg principle? It sounds obvious, but at the same time, not so much. 500 years ago, Professor Howe used that principle to deduce how spirit channeling works. Although, people still channeled beforehand, right? They just didn't know what they were doing. Yeah. Since spirits have no apparent physical form, people weren't aware they existed at all. But Professor Howe surmised that something had to be converting the mana from our mana lobes into arts. And that turned out to be spirits. Yep. His hypothesis was proven with the discovery of spirits that had taken physical forms. And because he figured out what was inside the egg, the age of spirit arts was born. Exactly. Although there's still a lot we don't understand about spirits. Like Maxwell being a busty 20-year-old. Bet even Professor Howe didn't see that coming. What a beautiful view. I bet if I yelled really loud, it would echo back. So why not try it? You gotta do things like that while you're still young. When you get to be my age, it can get a little embarrassing. Yeah, all right, why not? Echo! Echo, 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 echo. Alvin? Alvin, 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 Alvin. And what you're doing now isn't embarrassing? A little, a little, a little, a little. Oh boy, that handmaid of yours is a piece of work. I don't value his temper, but he is quite skilled. He said he's been serving you for years. Yes, he cleans up the shrine, he runs errands, always with a lot of enthusiasm. He buys my clothes and arranges them into outfits. What? Wow, your handmaid has exquisite taste. Yes, the clothes are very comfortable. I quite like them.
Oh, I guess I haven't properly introduced Elise yet. I'm Elise Ludis. Hello. Well, you look like you'll be a fine lady when you grow up. I'm Alvin. It's nice to meet you. I, um, well... Don't talk to strangers, Elise! Strangers are bad. Why is this stuffed animal talking? Huh? Tipo always talks. Naturally! Oh, so I'm the one who's reacting strangely? Sure looks that way! <laughs> I'm arguing with the stuffed animal. How unusual. Unusual, she says. Coming from you, Mila? Excuse me, when is the next ship leaving for Fenmont? I'm afraid the Rashigal government has blockaded the capital and its surrounding regions. That means all scheduled voyages to Fenmont have been cancelled. We apologize for the inconvenience. Are any ships sailing? Sorry, ma'am. Ah, uh, but the route to Sapstrath Seahaven is still open. Would you like a ticket to Sapstrath Seahaven? Very well. Please board the ship and await departure. That's not something you see every day. You get your mail by carrier pigeon? Something like that. It's how I keep in touch with someone special from afar. I told her a beautiful woman has appeared in my life. Hey, I didn't know you were married. <laughs> Do I look like the marrying type to you, Mr. Honor Student? Huh? You mean you're not? Who knows? Oh, looks like we're about to depart. Yeah. Impressive, huh? Just what was that girl doing in the village? Wasn't she being held captive? Maybe it was the other way around. Maybe she was being protected. <laughs> Elise? <laughs> Tipo, look! Well, hey! Check out that water! You'd die if you fell in. She's not a bad girl. It doesn't seem that way. I wonder if we'll find someone who'll take her in. That's your responsibility. You'll have to find someone on your own. Right. I guess she really is mad. <laughs> 